Levi, and in this video I'd like to show you some tips for maximizing your pulse sensors. The very first thing we want to do is when you get a new treadmill or a bike or an elliptical, when you're ready to start using it, you need to remove this plastic film that covers the pulse sensors. This will allow good contact between your skin and the electronics that run them. A couple more quick things. Um, make sure you hold both pulse grips. It usually takes at least 15 seconds, sometimes even 30, to get a, a reading into the machine. Um, depending on how dry or wet your hands are, you'll see different results. Usually they need to be a little bit moist. Also, for safety's sake, be sure that you step to the side of your treadmill, put your feet on the side rails, and hold the pulse grips when you want a pulse reading. Um, on ellipticals and bikes, you, you probably also want to pause your workout to get a uh, most accurate reading. All right, for best results, make sure that you keep the pulse sensors clean using a dry cloth. Make sure that you don't use any chemicals or anything. 